Good morning, Stephanie Cameron, the Stock Whisperer, here with today's Daily Dark Pool Whispers for November 20th, 2020. Happy Friday, everybody. We are going to start with the SPY. So where is the SPY? Uh, pretty much where it was yesterday, remember? <laughs> uh, having deja vu. Yeah, we're stuck um, between the four and the eight once again is it gonna push up to this top trend line yeah that's right here my last targets or is it going to fall down below the 8 ema bearish below 356 and go to this 15 exponential moving average those are the two possible trade setups for today on the spy let's go to the iwm uh, IDM, IWM, yeah, pretty much same situation. Started a little bit higher, but it's still stuck right on that four EMA. So bullish above 177.25, bear below 175.50 for the Russell. And that would be a retracement trade back down to the eight exponential moving average. QQQ, we're gonna be bullish above 294. Qs are right now currently just slightly above that four EMA, by the way, bear below 292. And now we're going to head over to the futures. Let's start with those uh, E minis. Bullish above 3585 and bear below 3562. We're in between the NASDAQ futures bullish above 12,020. You can see we've tested it two times here. Yep, unable to go above that. So if we do go rip roaring above that, if not, we'll most likely come on down. So let's go to the, uh, oh, let's go to the oil futures. Friday, what is oil gonna do? They love to wait until Friday to paint this candle for us. Oh, every single Friday we go through this. It's just such a pattern. And they've faked us out, yeah, two weeks in a row going up to that big trend line and backing down again so let's see what they do today keep your eye last hour all right so we did come down to this camarilla on the five minute chart a couple times bear below 4160 i went lower this is a nice little short trade yep if you're a good scalper but here's the big the big kahuna if we go below all these camarillas and pivots then there's a nice trade down to s1 uh, bull above 42.40 right here is my up trade. So I have a pretty big no trade zone. NT on the oil. They can fake us out left and right a little bit today. Let's head on over to gold futures. And what are those guys doing? We did get some volume as we came down to this pivot. See that? Yep, computers are programmed to buy. Perfect example. Look at the big blue volume bar. As soon as we hit the pivot, we bounced. We came down again. See this? Another pretty big spike there. Now we're headed up to that Camarilla. Resistance and big volume came in. Yep, computers are programmed to sell there. Bullish above 1871. Yeah, I kind of went a little bit higher on here for the bull above and bear below 1857 if we do go here. So I have a pretty big no trade zone as well for gold futures. Let's head on over to crypto, BTC futures. Absolutely. Um, watching the pre-market volume coming in. And I'm gonna be bullish above 18,500. That is a big level. Um, that is pretty much right above this Camarilla. And you can see the coast is clear if we do go above that. Bear below 18,200. Yeah, if we go below this Camarilla right here, that's our, so we have bull trade and we have a bear trade right there. All right, let's go to the individual stocks. I know some people may be new to the whispers and how I map them out. So I'm just gonna go through LI. Um, bullish above 37.50. My first target is 37.75. The reason I picked that target 
is we have John Persons Camarilla R1. That's what that means, R1. Next target is 3811. That's a Camarilla resistance, All right? See that? 3850 is a regular level. 3877 is R2. 3937, Camarilla. That's what these guys mean. That is where you take your profits, not where you enter. Entering on levels um, is really key, major price levels, and I teach you all about that. And boot camp coming up in two weeks, you guys. So bearish below 36 for LI. Let's go to NEO. All right, Paul already rocked this pre-market. Nice job, Paul, on that. Um, I like the 49 level. Yep, 49. If we can break above that, look out above. Yeah, lots of empty space there. Uh, bear below 47 for a retracement trade. Yep, that's between the 4 and the 8 EMA retracement trade. Let's head on over to American Airlines. This is in the dark pool insights. Uh, from last week, we're going to be bullish above 1302 today and bear below 1250. And speaking of insights, um, I just put it out last night. Um, and a reminder this morning, I have a special edition for you guys, a holiday special where I'm walking you through specific trades that we have taken in the, in the Java pit, my traders and I, teaching you a lot about different option trades, how to trade the prints, even how to trade crypto. So, yep, enjoy that. It's about an hour long. Yeah, it's a long one, but it's an educational one this week. Since I will be traveling, um, I just will not be able to do the trade setups. But last week, I gave you two weeks worth of swing trade. So those are still, um, still valid. All right, let's go to Carnival. Carnival CCL, bullish above 1850 and bearish below 1787. All right, let's go to Solo. Solo, bullish above 1050 and bear below 880. We had a dark pull level yesterday at 880. So if we do go below that, yep, that's when we return bearish. XPEV, bullish above 5051. And we're going to be bearish below 48 for XPEV. That's a retracement trade on that one. Uh, let's go to Tesla. Yeah, Tesla looks really interesting. We're pretty much trying to hang on to that 500 level. I'm going to be bullish above 505.50 today. Yeah, key level. Bear below 492.50 for a retracement trade back down to that 4 exponential moving average. CBAT, CBAC Energy. Yep, came back down to the 8 EMA and bounced up off of it. So we're going to be bullish above 850, bear below 675. Plug is next. Could be a little bit choppy this trade. Uh, as I was mapping it out, it was a little bit difficult, but bullish above 2425, bear below 2350. KDI, huge winner yesterday. Hope you guys caught this one. Uh, bullish above 1520 and bear below 14. BLNK, blink charging. Check that one out. Yeah. Bullish above 2020 today and bear below 19. There you have it. Those are your whispers for November 20th, 2020. Happy holidays, everybody. Until next time, happy trading. No thinking, that's my secret. Can you keep it? My secret. My secret